Hello viewers, welcome to 2 on 1 TV production and we are still continuing with the tournament, the international gala live here in Bugema and we are now in the final, the teams which made the final, Somali and Congo. So we are going to start it right now, a lot of interviews are coming and excitement, a lot of things are going to come on your way. Let's get it started. Viewers, I have here a very big guest with me here and he's going to introduce himself to us. Hello. Hello, my name is Elton Chilenga Quinson. I come from Zambia. Uh, Elton, uh, you are the organizer of the tournament. So, how did you come with that program? Like, you know, coming up with the tournament from the beginning, there are a lot of things. Okay, the, what difficulties did you face? Um, first of all, I'm not the organizer of the tournament. The tournament has been there for the past years. But uh, this time around, I just thought of adding more color and life to it. So I decided to come on board and uh, we incorporated with the Minister of Sport, who allowed me to be part of their uh, plans. And uh, we came up with something that uh, we need to make it more colorful for this international gala. So you are the aspiring coming uh, president, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is this, is this one of the strategies that you have come up with in order for you to gain uh, you know, the support of the students? If I was the one who had organized the uh, sports gala, it would be seen so. But the sports gala came at a time when there is also politics. If it had come in December, still I feel like leadership is taking responsibility of any situation rather than blaming. So I took the responsibility of saying, let us me make it to something that I want to see, not always saying it should have been done this way. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's so interesting. Now that, okay, uh, soon we are going to, for the campaigns, I don't know, which, which preparation do you have, like, okay, uh, for you to get the votes that from the respective international schools? I think uh, when it comes to uh, campaigns, the issue of leadership should uh, be the paramount thing that students should look for. So many times we look at uh, the people who we are closely related to, uh, people who we are friendly to, but uh, at the end of the day, they don't serve the need of the students. But we need to look at the person who is going to look at the needs of the students and serve them without any problem. And uh, above all, students also want to look at someone who will stand for them despite any problem that might face them. Yeah. So what is, what is your final message to the students out there? Oh, to the students out there, I wish you a very successful semester. And above all, remember to always choose what is right and not what people tell you that is right. You yourself have a conscience and your conscience will tell you that this is the right person. But sometimes we always choose the other simply because we are persuaded by other people. It's a strong message. I'm already, I'm already happy about that message, and I know you're having those qualities. Thank you for your time. Uh, thank you very much, 211. Please remember to subscribe to 211. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, hello, viewers. Here with me, I have a guy, a uh, very handsome guy with me. Hello. I'm Somali President. I'm Mohammed Abdullah Ali. Okay. Uh, Mohammed, so now that you people have made it to the final, uh, how do you see your team? Like, will they really take the trophy or don't have that hope? Uh, we are playing uh, before this match, uh, six match, uh, we win uh, four, one of uh, that match we take a draw and one we lost. Uh, you see that is uh, shows and predict our, uh, our how we can prepare to take uh, this trophy. Uh, we are playing this cup uh, 10 years and we are not uh, going to come to uh, final, it's our first time and this time we are really happy to take uh, this cup for this year. This is our year for Somalis. Yeah, this is, this is the president of Somalia and he has given us the message. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Uh, welcome to One One Area Code. Um, as you can see behind here, we are actually having the Bugema tournament. It's an international, all countries. I'm called Muranansi. I'm here with Minister of Sports, as you can see. You. Tell us your names. And yeah, what you're doing and your posting here in Bugema. Okay. Uh, thank you so much for hosting me here right now. Actually, I'm very excited. Um, I'm by the name of Diane James Gabriel, a student, of course, of Bugema University. She said before the sport minister. 
Bogema University. You organized this and how the challenges you faced, how you overcame it, all those things about we need to know about them. Thank you. Uh, first and foremost, this is for all internationals in Bogema University. We have almost like 20 something, like 20 plus international uh, foreigners in this university. One big achievement was football. Yeah, so we came up with this tournament. Just the main reason is to bring us together, nothing else. It's not we are not here to compete or oh, one day win or what what. Okay. Uh what you you we have heard from you, uh, like the mission and then the goal as to why you organize this tournament every time. So we want you to tell us like the challenges you've overcome. Like yeah, because these things come with challenges. Everything has challenges. So you want I want us I want you to tell us the challenges you faced and how you overcame or other supporting figures that helped you to overcome them. That's true. Uh, one of the big thing challenges we challenges actually we faced here is support. Yeah, you know sometimes we have this this all organizing all this thing requires money. Yeah, you know, and to subscribe for this thing every country here even these guys here we we had like seven countries not played and from the beginning but now this is the final day yeah so all of them subscribe so we, one big thing is the money and secondly we don't have time you know primary thing why we are here is education yes yeah, so if you leave part of education out once entertainment we come to football yeah so those are the challenges actually we faced here yeah. okay uh, we're so happy that you overcame the challenges because you know most people don't overcome them they see it as a challenge piling up you know so as a um, as you as you introduced yourself as a minister of sports, what else have you seen that you've brought into while you were in power that wasn't here around in Bugema? Uh, like you can see on the other table, <laughs> we've never had those things in the history of Bugema. Yeah, we've never had them. We've been playing football just for fun. You don't care about who wins or what. You win, yes, but there's, there's no appreciation that we give out to the people outside. But today I'm glad during my time and plus even some t small tokens now we are going to give to the players yeah okay uh thank you so much for giving us your time and then maybe one or two words for the viewers out there those ones who love sports basically yes what do you have to tell them guys football is talent and you should come to bugema to see come to bugema you'll get everything here thank you so much Okay, thank you for that time that you've given us. We feel so happy and um, yeah, as it's taking place, actually, it's live in Bugema. I hope all you guys, other students who are wishing to come in, you should come and join Bugema because actually it's the best university. We love our people, we are one people and then yeah, we just want to thank you so much for your time again. Yeah, yeah thank you so much. Uh, viewers, we are still here live and the match is continuing. Actually, Congolese, they are leading 1-0. Uh, and with me, I'm having these beautiful fans here. They are always supportive of their team. Hello. Hello. What's your name? My name is Zone Tushindi. Yeah. In the semi-final, we are there. Even if uh, from first half, you people believed and you really made it to the final. So now that you people are in the final and you have already scored the goal, do you think there's a possibility of taking the trophy? Yeah, I think so. So, Okay. I know that also Mali, they are also pressing, you know, for them, they know how to play. They are also playing good. And this is still first half. Don't you think they are going to give you a lot of hard time? No, they will not because I believe in my team. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what's your name? My name is Lily Mwim. I know you are so, so happy. And I'm, I'm sure the happiness is still continuing because your team is still, your team is still leading. It's li uh -huh. And I know in 30 minutes we are going to make another one. Wow. Yes. Meaning the final you guys are taking the trophy today is going to be yours. Yeah, the cup is for Congo. Today we are going to take that cup. That's that's so good. So anyway, thank you people for your time. Yeah. I hope to see you in the final. <laughs> we so. Thank you. Fine too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, the Somali big fan and they said hello. How? How are you? Fine, sir. How are you? Thank you. Mm, what's your name? My name is Abdurrahman. Yeah. Uh, now that you have seen, okay, the match is so tight, uh, you people have already considered, but it's still first up. Do you think there's a possibility of you overcoming that goal? Yeah, of course, because we are the best team here. And also, you know, uh, it is too early to, 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 say, to, uh, to judge, you know. We are remaining by the most of the time, so we are, I think, I think uh, we are going to win this cup. Hopefully, because now it is the first time, first half, I mean. So I think uh, we are going to win. That's our hope, man. And we are playing with our brother. This tournament is all about integration, nothing else. 
we are not enemies, we are not what, we are just playing to know each other. That's the, uh, our, our theme. And I think we are going to overcome this goal and we will give to Congo, I think so. Oh, I like that confidence. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, you are teaming. They know how to play. They play very nice. But anyway, I hope you people also take the trophy. Even if you don't take, as you have said, it's something that brings friendship, you know. Yeah, we are all international students. So it's just that friendship to link us together. So anyway, thank you for your time. So what is the final message you can give to the fans out there who are supporting yeah. you? Because I'm seeing there are a lot of people who are supporting Somali right now. You can say, uh, no, uh, keep hope, you know. Uh, don't lose hope, because this is our best team. Because we are still live and we are continuing more fans. We are going to be interviewing a lot of fans here. The match is still on fire. And with me here, I also have a very beautiful girl here. A big fan of Congo. Hello. Hi. What's your name? I'm Sharifa. Salifa, uh, in the semi-final, you people, uh, you made it really to the final today and you people are already leading. Do you think the trophy is finally for you? Is it for Congo or they still, uh, the stand-up which may happen? The truth shows it so, for sure. We are the winners. Because we are winning, we have been winning, and we are still winning. So win winners can never lose. That's what, that makes us to be winners all the time. So what message do you have for the fans out there who are also going to be supporting Congo? You know, we have fans there who, who are watching you people, who are supportive of your, your team. What message do you have for them? Like, to be always strong and to be determined in whatever they do because they are, they are winners, they are great people. No one can defeat them in this world. When it's, it's, it's time for game. Okay. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for your time. Okay, thank you. Now, viewers, we have come to the end of the match, and actually, as you're seeing here, uh, we have the medals here for the losers and the winners. The gold ones are for the winners, and the organizers are also here. Uh, the trophy, they are going to be giving the, the medals up and plus the, the trophy. So, after here, it's going to be also a serious celebration, you know. You know, as the winning team, you have to be expecting a lot of happiness and... People are going to celebrate. They are going to be giving the medals. Uh, the Somali team, they are giving them the, the medals, the gold medals. You can see the goalkeeper, uh, the captain. The captain is the one leading. Uh, people are very happy. People are very happy. Yeah. Somali is the champion of the international girl. Game. You can see the excitement, the happiness. People are very happy, the trophy is here. Uh, we are going to be interviewing a lot of people. But first, enjoy the excitement. We are really see how, how happy they are. People are very happy. The winners are really celebrating. And the trophy is here. So, yeah, what arrangement are you yeah. having for the fans out there? Yeah, we, ha we are going to have a, a big ceremony. Uh -huh. A big party for, for all of us, which we can celebrate. And I think we are going to announce it later this evening. So we will tell everyone uh, when time is uh, uh, when we are ready. Okay, for the, we are the party. For the party, yeah. Wow, 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 wow. You are yes. so happy, and I'm happy yeah, that yeah. you had that confidence. Before yeah. I interviewed you, yeah. when you were beaten 1-0, yeah. but you said no, yeah. you can make it, and you have really made it. Yes, because we, we had. Why were we saying that? Because we have got the best team here, and you you were saying we were, you were watching not so. Yeah. These people they play with discipline even. You see, and we are going to. Even we are going to greet our brothers because they, they, they we, we don't see us, we, they lost. Yeah. We, all of us, we won because this tournament was all about uh, integration of, uh, of international students. You see? So I, I think we are happy and we urge everyone to celebrate with us because we are a champion of, uh, of Bukema University. Of Bukema, yeah, yeah. Yes. International student. International student, yeah. yeah so what, what message do you have for the fans of, of, of Congolese out there? Yes, we are, uh, you guys, this was all about integration. So it does mean that uh, you lost. Which means we, we, we have to... This, this idea was all about it, uh, interacting with each other. You see, so we are saying uh, Congolese... You uh, get ready, maybe next year you are going to win also. Yeah, so for us it was the first time to win uh, this uh, trophy. Since we came, we joined uh, Bukemi University. So I think we waited long. Wow, thank you, thank you. And Kongs for your, for your achievement. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you.